Hey cuties, Peachy here. Welcome back to a new video. And in this video, oh my gosh, we have so much Rainbow High Series 4 leaks to cover and news and just... Oh my god, I'm dying already. Okay, let's get okay, started. Okay, so it'll start it with at Mordecai Wolfgang once again. They posted this... Uh, these pictures these listings that um on amazon italy they were live they were the series four girls were live you could buy them and they even bought um one of the girls jewel richie who at the time uh had not been unboxed yet so that was exciting uh note um i'm saying at the time yes it's because we do have unboxed pictures of her now. i actually went on amazon italy myself and i did in fact find the girls except for uh delilah and i even like copy pasted the code and everything from the listing on the picture that mort shared on instagram and i still got nothing so maybe delilah like got sold out or something but like she, i couldn't find her but i could find the other ones and it's really weird because on, on a lot of them they had varied uh delivery dates um some of them would come like in two weeks in may some of them in june and like girl what the it's really it's really like random and i i really don't like that it's really weird what's happening right now with amazon they're just kind of like dropping series four and it's just really random like at the times that they're actually getting released like now they are also listed on amazon france uh and on amazon germany but on those two they're you can't buy them right now it just says currently unavailable and un unavailable on all of them and under Mina's, actually, it kind of gives you, at least on Amazon Germany, it gave me this date that they're going to be released in October. Like, what? <laughs> that is obviously wrong. That has to be false, right? Right? <laughs> Oh my god, this is so crazy. I Now it does this. seem that these series four girls are also getting like slowly released in stores, at least in Italy. They have been popping up, but they have been cited by a lot of people. Um, as we can see here, thanks to uh, Mordecai Wolfgang on Instagram on their latest post on Rainbow High stuff. Um, and like that is just wow. So they are popping up in stores and they can purchase them. And like, so that means like they're in Europe. They are in Europe. And like, I'm like, what? I'm literally waiting for them to drop. Like, I'm waiting. I'm just waiting. Like, what is happening right now? One of those people being at La Stregata Luna. You know, girl, I got some Italian juices flowing in me too. <laughs> they actually, they're some of the people uh, that actually got Series 4 in stores. And they actually got um, almost all six. They are missing Delilah. But um, honestly, we've seen so much of Delilah. We're like, I'm over. Like, I, I'm, I'm okay. Like, I want to see more of the other girls. Okay, like... Um, so they actually got all five, again, except for Delilah, in box. And here are the box pictures. Um, they do take them out in, of the box. So that's great. We will look at those pictures in a second. And they just, in general, they posted so many pictures of all these girls in the box, out of the box. Like, they made videos and everything. So um, I will leave the link to their profile down below. Please check it out. They make also just amazing pictures in like from other dolls. So, like, honestly laying okay like now let's take a look at the um out of the box pictures so here we have the profile um here we have mila first um and what's weird to me like i like her but what's weird to me is like maybe just for this lighting but she, her hair looks very pink it looks like very it has like very pink undertones but um here's mina now she does she doesn't come with that like extra shawl that they display her in that's that doesn't come with her but it's really cute and she is so pretty oh my god and now we have jewel jewel honey jewel this is actually not the first time we're gonna see jewel in this video yes 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 we're gonna actually see a full unboxing later on um and she's so pretty look at her and then coco i feel like coco they did her so dirty before um in the stock photos she looked kind of off but here look at her eyes look at her lips i feel like she has a mix of phaedra's nose and lips and like the new eyes and like face mold i don't know and then here we have lila and lila it's so weird all the lilas we've seen so far in box in real life per pictures they all have messed up bangs. we'll talk about her when we get to her now let's talk about mila out of the box see what i mean like she's supposed to be burgundy and in previous pictures that never really popped that never really 
uh, showed up to me. But look, look her, the back of her hair. It's almost purple. They put in like purpley pink streaks in her hair. And I'm like, what? <laughs> like, I mean, I guess it looks pretty, but um, she's supposed to be burgundy. I mean, I don't know. To me, it just doesn't make sense to put in purple. She's supposed to be a really deep, rich red and putting in purple and like these undertones of pink and purple it's just, i don't know how i feel about that uh because just especially here because it looks so obvious but um otherwise she is very nice and at least she is a new really unique tone of red other than ruby lily and um daria which kind of to me daria is kind of red and pink she's not pink to me she's kind of a little bit of both because she is a very dark kind of pink but she's also kind of red so yeah she, at least at least mila is a really unique shade of next red. up we have mina and i this the face up for her here it looks stunning look at her okay every time i see her i feel like i fall more more in love with her um and we can actually see that she does come with the extra legs and so does mila but i don't know why they're not on screen in the last picture next up here's jewel and what's really interesting is that actually the girls that only come with heels they don't come with the extra pair of legs that is so weird and then here we have coca and she's so precious look at her face oh she has such a gorgeous face like initially she was not one of my faves like i'm honest here like she she was my my least fave i think but look at her i feel like i don't know what it was about our stock photos that made her look angry or kind of weird but here her makeup everything just sits right and her lips are so big and like they look like brat slips almost i love the sheen i love her eye color her makeup her hair the hair is gorgeous and like okay i'm still not totally in love with her pieces but i'm sure i can juice something around and make her look stunning um as she deserves to be because like she her she has one of the most beautiful face ups i've ever seen like i'm she's quickly becoming one of my faves lastly I'm sure. we have lila here and yeah those bangs honey i don't know what's going on with her bangs all the lilas we've seen so far they have all had all of them have had messed up bangs <laughs> i'm scared um yeah i'm definitely gonna get her in store i'm gonna get all of these in store because i'm not gonna girl mm -mm, i'm gonna go i'm gonna waste my, my pennies on some dolls that have some weak ass makeup or some like loose hairs i want to get my my dolls perfect okay looking perfect so definitely gonna get all of these in store um i just i also like to hunt i also like the feeling of finding them in store and just being able to pick the best one but lila here yeah i don't know what's going on her bangs all messed up all they all look so bad it's reminding me of the uh omg a fly girl from the world travel series remember her <laughs> yeah oh my gosh bless her soul her bangs were a mess um people were having a field day with fixing her bangs and even just getting the like headset on her girl mm. <gasps> I, ha I remember I had to like rubber band that that dang little headset around her head like four times yeah with four different separate r rubber bands elastic bands so but yeah I do hope that they will fix her bangs in later um uh ship shipments of of Lila dolls like I do hope that this is just the early the early uh Lila dolls that have these messed up bangs and that the that they will fix it in in later Lila dolls um I really hope so because oh and God. if you're still wondering what their focuses are thanks to at ash and silverstone on instagram they very kindly put them all on screen in one spot so mila has photography focus amina has accessory design delilah has creative writing jewel fashion design coco digital media and then lila has visual art going back to the rainbow high series for palooza of sightings and we have to, uh, we have this picture here of Mila and Delilah out of the box. Again, someone found them. And then here's Delilah solo. Um, yeah, she's still like really cute, but here her blush is very heavy. Then here we have Mila and Delilah in the box. Um, yeah, these are new pictures and all thanks to uh, Mordecai Wolfgang on Instagram once again um i'm not sure if these were found in italy too or if these were found in america because later on we will find um we will talk about some pictures that were actually found in walmart america too so they're popping up literally worldwide like, remember in the last video where we talked about at miss marifel here unboxing the very first lila doll we had seen and she actually found her in the netherlands and thanks to her pointing out in which store in which area someone else actually found the other lilas and they actually got both of them so yeah that's exciting that's really nice it's like a full circle moment right there and i'm so glad people are helping each other to kind of um 
yeah, to, to see where these dolls are at because it's a crazy time. Toyboy Universe here share two pictures of Lila and her bangs are so messed up and Coco here that were apparently found in Wallop. I'm not sure if that's a store, if that's an area, if that's, yeah, no clue, but um, they're being found and <laughs> scratched out. We have another sighting of Coco here and this picture was found in the Telegram chat. And these dolls, like remember I was talking about how some of these dolls were found in the US. Well, these Series 4 girls were all spotted. All six of them were spotted in California in a Walmart. I mean, what? <laughs> so they're pairing, they're popping up in America and they're popping up in Europe all over websites and stores. I mean, I don't know why Rainbow High doesn't just release the dang things like what and here we get into the full-on unboxing of jewel richie here on uh, doll badger's instagram thank you to them for uh just sharing this whole process so here she is in the box and as we can see right here the makeup on hers is a little bit um darker i guess yeah definitely with these dolls where the makeup's supposed to be dark you gotta you got, i would prefer to see them in person to see if the makeup's on point but here she was in her first outfit and here she is without her little fur stool it's a separate piece and it's so cute here is a close-up of the little fur um wrap around thing it looks really well made and at first it is attached to the dress but those are just little plastic kajinkers um <laughs> as mommy's world would say <laughs> and then here's a dress and here she is in her second outfit i mean Stunning. I definitely feel like the second outfit and the first outfit, I want to mix them up together. I want to find a mix and find my own kind of vibe. And then here is a cl it is a better look at the second outfit. Uh, she's not, she doesn't have her hands. The jacket is stunning, honestly. And then the shoes are very simple. But here she is fully in the nude. Um, as we can see, the better markings of her vitiligo, the, the, the color, this pigmentation on her skin it's all over her body in places you would never even see i mean that is just detail that is that's attention to detail right there mga oh my gosh thank you um they're not cheaping out y'all that's that's amazing and yes it does look a little iffy because some parts look more pinkish than their actual supposed color which i do think is a malfunction but either way i'm pretty sure that's in some cases that's actually real life for some people that have vitiligo so honestly it's okay i don't feel like it plays too much uh, of a role because it looks stunning they did way. wash her hair and look it is so long and so thick and she is really nicely rooted not like series three don't worry y'all and it's really long and we do again we have our focus and we can even see a peek of the back of the uh, second outfit boxes it's shimmery like no one would even see that but they didn't have to do that so <laughs> lastly here's a close-up of her accessories her earrings um her earrings are a different mold from chanel onyx's earrings they just look very similar in shape but they are different molds in fact and her little bracelets are not too delicate they do have the little cut in them so they're not they're not going to break easily but it's i mean all these accessories like i just imagine back in series one we had no accessories girl no just ex excluding some pairs of earrings i mean that's just crazy right and now we have like full-on like little bracelets and earrings and, and like chokers <gasps> i mean how the times have changed right and at ashton silverstone uh posted this on their story saying uh that the official release date is uh, may 13th <laughs> and then i actually got to see in white they wrote for legal reasons this is a joke and so i don't know if this is actually a joke or if you know because i do feel like my, i mean we talked in the last video about how the the listings on the website on the polish website um from my friend amelia right she she found that website and she told me that the release day like for pre-orders or whatever pre-sale was gonna be on tomorrow the 13th may 13th so um I don't know maybe there is some truth in that maybe they will start rolling out like massively across the whole globe i don't know this is so very yeah, confusing and it's even more confusing because they uh, the official rainbow high website uh website the official rainbow, rainbow high instagram just posted their first series four um like little teaser pic of one of the characters um and it's of myla uh, mila myla <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> um and so they just posted they just started with the series four pictures posting them so and it's it's crazy because they're so behind series four is already being found and like they're only now posting the series four girlies like what? <sighs> okay let's just take a moment to like chill and look at these cute ass socks shall we 
These socks were found by Doll on the Go on Instagram, and they actually got the information from X Canadensis on Instagram. So that's super cute. Look at these socks. Um, they were found on Walmart or Target, one of those two stores. Um, they, I mean, look, they're so cute. I mean, I was almost kind of waiting for them to make rainbow high socks right no one else or like shirts honestly i'm i'm yeah i'm shocked they haven't made like rainbow high sock uh shirts yet with like the iconic logos and stuff yeah i'm waiting for those to kind of come out and i checked my instagram before closing out this video so i didn't miss any new pictures coming out and i'm so glad i did because uh mort actually just got their drill richie in the mail and here she is and they uh said they would um make a review on her tomorrow so again i will link their deeds down below stay uh alert for the review uh on their youtube or instagram i mean she's stunning i'm so excited i'm so happy for i feel her. like this video feels so long because there's so much information squashed very tightly packed into this 15 minute video so i hope it's okay for y'all um but yeah i hope you enjoyed be sure to give me a big thumbs up if you did be sure to leave me any thoughts or questions down below let me know what you thought of these pictures these leaks who are you most excited to see to get your hands on um and are you also kind of like wh getting whiplash by all these dolls coming out so fast i mean i i like girl i need to like just like <laughs> just sit down and and just try to not lose my crap you know <laughs> let me know what you thought down below and as always don't forget to subscribe hit the notification bell if you haven't already so you don't miss want to post more rainbow high doll news like this doll reviews series four very soon i hope and episode reaction videos tomorrow we have a new episode are you excited i'm excited okay i'm gonna let y'all go okay bye okay no i'm not i don't say bye that's not part of my outro okay um stay safe be kind i hope this next time stay peachy kisses